and that, that's cute at all. And it's no shade. I'm just a regular pierogi type of guy, like cheddar pierogi with you know cheese and butter. potato. Yep. Right with uh, and sauteed onions. Man, if you if you put some just regular potato pierogies out, I could I could eat those like Pac Man, just like. Yeah. <laughs> well, you make really good pierogies at home. But my wife makes them. Oh, it's I, Mrs. I just Patlin eat them. That makes them. Okay, got it. I'm, the, I'm the taste tester, but uh, <laughs> no, she, she uses uh, my my grandma dragon's recipe. That was my, my grandma's last name. I have my grandma and grandpa dragon, but their, their recipe. So that's the good stuff. Now we have these clouds. Uh, I got Petlin as the last name, <laughs> not, not, not the cool one. <laughs> we got these clouds uh, down to the south, some showers too. Those uh, start moving in from the south and those will continue to build our way. Tonight, we have no worries. We'll see maybe a few clouds by early morning, but the better shot for rain is actually Sunday. We will get a few showers though tomorrow as this moisture overspreads the area. But Sunday's the day where we have this moisture in place and a cold front dropping in. And these two are going to meet up in western Pennsylvania for a rainy good time. So that's what we're going to be dealing with here. High pressure's moving out. Low pressure creeps in from the south. Low pressures, the clouds, the rain. That's going to overspread the region. So as this low comes into town here, that's our first dose of precipitation. And this is going to start arriving as spotty showers. Saturday as we get into the afternoon and evening hours. Now Sunday, by the time you wake up, this is going to be some pretty widespread rain. This low moves on. We catch maybe a little break with some spotty showers and drizzle in between, but then another batch of precipitation comes in from the west and that's going to be moving in towards Cincinnati around game time. So that's going to have some some uh, issues for the game. So rain is going to come into play in Cincinnati and that rain's eventually going to build towards us. So Saturday morning, nothing really to worry about Saturday afternoon, though. A few showers. These are going to be sort of hit or miss around. They become more consistent, more widespread for the afternoon and evening and you can see here by Sunday morning it's pretty widespread rain at times this rain is going to be on the heavier side that continues to cycle through we catch a little uh, late afternoon break before the next batch comes through with the cold front so tonight enjoy these very comfortable temperatures the low humidity and upper 50s because come tomorrow we're going to see temperatures topping off in the 70s in most cases. A couple spots will try to flirt with that 80 degree mark, including Pittsburgh, but it's going to be a little more humid and we're going to have those clouds increasing along with our rain chances through the day. So tonight, a beautiful night around. We're looking for 59 degrees, increasing clouds. Tomorrow, highs near 80 degrees, mainly cloudy, showers in the afternoon, but uh, overall, the, the rain tomorrow is going to be hit or miss and likely on the lighter side. Different story Sunday, widespread rain, especially from the morning into the afternoon with a little break for some drizzle and, and clouds during the afternoon hours. Sunday, Monday, more showers scattered around. Tuesday, the clouds left behind, but we'll be drying up and we get a little streak of sunshine Wednesday, Thursday and Friday with temperatures warming back up to the lower 80s this time next week.